in general, like, um, you know, in-game photography is something that has absolutely exploded um, in Yeah. recent years, and it's something that's in every game now. I don't know Yeah. if you've played that, but I will say it's another thing that Rockstar Games invented with uh, GTA V, technically invented back in the day, or at least made it made it cool, like really made it accessible with the um, with the Snapmatic app in that game. And then Yeah. you, just, you know, Rockstar sets the tone basically for open world gaming, sets the uh, standards. So then, of course, you know, uh, within the next few years, every everyone was doing it from, You know, you know, actually, that started with the uh, smartphones in the game. Like, you could uh, Yeah, take pictures exactly. with the smartphones. Then it went to uh, Rockstar Studios, I guess. They Yeah, added the a mod. editor. Yeah, That's that's yeah. the thing with the photo mode, to those of you who don't know. you Maybe you don't know the struggle of having to, like, wait an in-game day just to get the lighting right, just to get the uh, cars going right, to catch, go through 50 versions of a photo just to get the timing right. There's no freeze-framing anything. <laughs> Yeah, um, I actually have this problem with the uh, classic games. Like I, I literally wait with Ezio like for a day to get a good view or a good lighting. And Yeah. I was like, yeah, listening to the soundtrack, and that's good. You know, that's really that's something. Yeah. You know. <laughs> But but it was it it was the humble beginnings and and there was there, there is something fun to it just doing it differently I suppose um and then like you say the rock style it came along making everything just way cooler um They're always like this, like they set some yeah. set a new boundary in gaming. that's Always. the that, that's another thing you know Red Dead Redemption Two which came out uh, a few years later it also started with just an in game camera there um Yeah. and we didn't have like a and then like a year later. Uh, like uh, a photo mode like that came so you can also uh, you know freeze frame and get different angles and which was pretty pretty cool for getting like Red Dead is also action a very packed shots beautiful game. what's that Uh, Red Dead Redemption 2 is also a very beautiful game, like spectacular landscapes. yeah another one of probably yeah Arthur Morgan himself. the best games ever <laughs> basically yeah, um I totally but agree. Yeah, um, but like like we were saying, you know, it was there. Like, uh, I mean, people. Some people would say that gaming photography technically started with, with like the map editor in Halo, like uh, almost twenty years ago. Which I know what they're talking about, but I never really played that stuff to to maybe have a Yeah, me full too. opinion on it. Um, but let's say that you know, Rockstar kind of you know they uh, modernized it. mainstreamed Yeah. it and then you know in the following years everyone was doing it in I actually every game can't remember the first game that it had a real functional photo mode. I, I think it was Uncharted 4. I don't know. I, or Last of Us. I think it was The Last of Us. that could be uh the remaster version or or the original The remaster version. oh yeah for sure that would um that would, Yeah. that would make better sense chrono uh, chronologically <laughs> um yeah. but no you know For AC, it started with Origins, which was um, very fresh, uh, well-needed edition. And I can't help but think that, um, like, some of the older games, what would I give to, like, be able to, like, you know, get freeze-frame shots and action-packed shots and just better better shots than having to turn off the HUD and, you know, uh, playing with the angles until you get it just right. Exactly, especially Unity, you know, we actually, Unity and we, Syndicate, especially. we, I mean, like Memento Gallery, he really tried to bring a photo mode to Unity, but actually nobody listened. So he Yeah. just went to PC and installed mods. Yeah. Um, because still, you know, I will, you know, in the Ezio games, I'll go into first person camera, get some shots if, if I see something. Landscapes, yeah. black flag in that. I'll, I'll just turn off the HUD entirely and press the character up against the wall. Till, till they're out of the picture and um, play around with the angle till I get a good shot and then edit in Mm -hmm. That's post. actually a challenging process, you know, to It, get it the is, good and, angle. and it's definitely restrictive in what kind of shots you can get, but Yeah. it also leaves you more satisfied with just like, just getting something instead of uh, like in Far Cry 5, just last night from, uh, and this is recorded, spending like 10 minutes trying to get the right shot. <laughs> Um, I actually had the I had a problem last night with Mirage. I was uh, yeah. capturing a shot, 
and I was like not satisfied with the angle, even if even even if it was in the photo mode. You know, it was like, nah, it doesn't work. <laughs> like I had like you know ten minutes or fifteen minutes in a single photo mode shot, so I actually captured six or seven shots from a single like scene. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Um, no, yeah, I mean, being, being a, an in-game photographer can be hard at points, but, uh, it's, uh, it's well worth it. Yeah. And it's definitely, like I said, yeah, it's something that's just exploded everywhere, especially in the AC community, like, uh, just, you know, ours, uh, the ones who came before, we have a really, uh, you know, strong VP community on, uh, on X and across mm -hmm. other socials, just everyone sharing their, their shots and, Like yeah. like you said, it's it's definitely a way to bring people together. Exactly. Yeah. Um, and I remember it back from like I said, like the Rockstar games. That was kind of days two. That was kind of how I got involved in gaming communities overall, was just sharing, you know, in-game captures, getting associated with so many people, and then, you know, that moved on to AC and and such and such.